Hello all, when we have a PCB that is ready for assembly, the bare PCB, we will have the bill of material which will be the input for the assembly, right? The bill of material indicates what components to be mounted, uh, means what MPNs and what components uh, should not be mounted. So that means mounted and not mounted components uh, should be clearly segregated in the BVM. Like example, if we see this uh, PCB, right? So here uh, we have um, components which are mounted, okay? So these are all the components which are mounted, but we can see some of the pads which are not mounted, okay? So the, here the components are not mounted how okay so the component is this way actually okay so how does a assembly guy uh, uh, get to know is basically we said it's from the bom list or we will have a separate dnp list now um, you can also see here this is one more component how to include this dnp in the schematic is very important because schematic is the interface from which uh, we get the uh, DNP related details uh, into the assembly. Okay, so let us look at uh, uh, how to include uh, the DNP components, how to indicate the DNP components, uh, especially in the KiCad. Here we have a simple schematic open again, we took the LM7805 for example, and when we double click, the symbol properties opens up. Now, if you see here, um, there is uh, uh, a attribute, an attribute called do not populate. So, do not populate means this uh, uh, is like will not be mounted on the PCB. So, now when we tick this and press OK, you can see here it shows a red cross in the schematic, which means this will not be populated. Now, let us try to generate uh, the BOM. Okay, we, we are just trying to generate the BOM. When we open the uh, BOM, you can see here these are the list of components in our schematic C1, C2, C3, and U1. And the U1 under the DNP section, you can see it is mentioned as DNP. Okay, so that means this component will not be mounted in the assembly. So assembly guys have this BOM, they know this should not be mounted and they'll skip this part. So this is how we indicate the DNP in schematic and that's how it flows down to the uh, assembly guys.